but we are hoping that we will be able to uh, design machines that can understand human behavior better. Working with the technology is really giving me as a professor and also my actors a leg up on a technology that is rapidly changing how professional actors will work in the future. My name is uh, Shrikant Narayanan. I'm the Andrew Viterbi Professor of Engineering at uh, the University of Southern California's Viterbi School of Engineering. People have always been interested in uh, studying human behavior, so we want to study human behavior in a more controlled, systematic settings, and people have been using actors. What we wanted to do here is to use you know, very specific acting techniques to be able to do this in a very systematic way. So I got together with my colleague in uh, the School of Theater, who has expertise in a number of acting techniques, including a technique called active analysis, you know, introduced by Stanislavski, and that's what you know uh, we are using for this particular study. How much do you have to do with me? <laughs> I want you to have dinner with me. I want peace and quiet. I want you to have dinner. The I data we get from this, quiet. you know, is you know multifold. It, we have data about you know, how they use their hands, their body, you know, the facial expression, and so on alongside with the, the language they use, the, their voice patterns and intonation, uh, how they use the space, how both these people, right, it's an interaction data. All these are recorded in a synchronized fashion, so we have you know, very, very rich data that you know, we're able to you know, quantitatively analyze you know, moment to moment to see how a particular person expresses behavior, in what context, and how they interact with one another. My name is Sharon Carnicky and I am a professor here at USC in both theater and Slavic languages and literatures. All the way. Let it go, shake your head. The conditions that actors are facing in the future are constantly changing and being reconditioned by technological developments and that is what the motion capture what's being coming to be called even more precisely performance capture so on the most practical level working with the technology is really giving me as a professor and also my actors a leg up on a technology that is rapidly changing how professional actors will work in the future. I believe that the future of theater studies is going to blend practice with scholarship and this program really brings those two aspects of theater work together. So as these technologies improve further, you know, there's a long ways to go, but we're hoping that we will be able to uh, design machines that can understand human behavior better, so it can lead to better diagnostics of, you know, human behavior, uh, and also be able to use, develop applications and interfaces where we can develop more natural responsive virtual human behavior, robotic behavior. So this can lead to, you know, better toys or even better training systems and so on.